Hello YouTube, this is Miss Chris Deacon. <clears throat> Apparently, before I do, before I even start the One Punch Man versus, not One Punch, the One Piece or the one Piece or Fairy Tale, One Punch Man came out yesterday. So we're gonna do that first. Um, so one twelve came out yesterday, but also a bonus chapter came out. One eleven point five. It's only eight pages long. We're gonna do this one first, and then we'll move on to the next one. It's called Own Items. Bonus chapter. Okay. Oh, Looks like it, we're taking time and we're the heroes up on top. A, the A and B class heroes. That weapon looks hard to handle. Try to use it in a way that you don't hit your allies when you're swinging around. I've been fighting using this guy for a long time. I ain't get, gonna miss like that. Will you guys be fine without having any weapons? I've got my baton. It was specially made for me <clears throat> by the artisans at the Hero Association. Hmm? You over there? Are you gonna fight barehanded? Tish. I have very various concealed weapons called hidden tools on me. There's at least 30 of them. Is that so? Interesting. Will you be fine looking all conspicuous like that? I'm also fully prepared for battle. I don't use any weapons. With my fantastic beauty, I will finish off. Ela. Ela quit quickly. I fight by controlling psychic power with the, this head gear, but will I be able to use it smoothly today? I feel anxious. It would have been nice if I had asked the association to have a head gun ready. We should keep some secret weapons in case of emergency. Huh? What is that luggage? It's remarkably huge. He's talking about Fat God. He has a giant backpack on. Mr. Pig God. I've not seen him fight be fight him before. I guess he's also uses some sort of device to fight. Ah, he's retrieving something from his luggage. Is it going to be a weapon? He's just having a snack. It's full of food. Speaking of, he was having something to eat back then as well. Is he going to have a snack again? There's surely something to it. Maybe it's a ritual before fighting. I also eat rice balls before heading out. Would you like to have one, Miss Big God? Thanks. So do you get an increase if in your fighting strength after eating? I just eat because I'm hungry. So it's not related to fighting at all? Refrain from the chit chatting and concentrate. Alright, sorry about that. I feel a, little, a bit less nervous now. Okay, 112, the power of light. We have female heroes in bathing suits on the front cover. I don't care. 
all that much. My favorite waifu from the series is Tasumaki. Uh, then the cover page has it has a uh, Sonic in a like a fur suit, a cat fur suit. Jenna's right by him in front of uh, Saitama. It'd be cool if si uh, Sonic became a hero of sorts. Up next, character story. We have Genos vacuuming the house. Vacuuming the house. We have Saitama lifting up the grid, and you see Tiro, Bomb, Bang, Wangama. Uh, Child Emperor, King, Guru Guru, Orochi, and Got Garu. Okay. Uh, ba 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 ba. Only because he's. Marching forward step by step only because he is the strongest. Oh Fuck we finally get into the chapter and one of the black sperm clones just punches Atomic Samurai in the chest. So you can just see him blown back Fuck What Even after splitting the monster still has so much power. I Miscalculated its strength. This isn't good. There are too many. S slash. He tried to slash, but he's just beat, getting beaten to a pulp like all over his body. You should just see blows over and over. He's just taking a beating. He might actually be taken down. Then he cuts the floor. Underneath him, killing a monster. Instead, he cut four floors beneath him, and all of them are looking down, trying to run. That is so pathetic. Still, you aren't getting away after hit after him. And one of them that jumped down. I got annihilated before splitting. Next one. I've dealt with space aliens that rendered my blade ineffective in the past. I have been thinking about this since. It's just a sample. Simple. Though. But. What if I just increase the number and speed of my slashes further? Even though the range would be greatly reduced. But my blade can penetrate with greater density. That was close. Concentrating. My slashes at one point is te a technique especially meant for monsters like you. Get reduced to dust. This guy. Focused. Atomic slash! And he just slashes all that focus energy to the big bunch that's jumping down. And he lands. That one... That was one tough monster. Ouch. It's been years since my wrist hurt like this. It's an unfamiliar technique. I can't go around using it too recklessly. Oh yeah, I have to go after the kid. And ah, oh, he's fucking jumping off the um the walls that he sliced. He's jumping off them crisscross, and you can just see him going up the hole. Oh, holy shit! 
shit. All of the black sperm combined into one giant one. He looks like a really buffed up tank from Life for Dead. And he's getting ready to just punch Samurai when he jumps out of the hole. Well, I hid my true self from the very beginning and sacrificed a tiny fraction of me, which really helped. Focus. Slash. It's too late. And Atomic Samurai just gets punched across the face you can see him get blown back but be when he's getting blown back he's slicing up the monster as m much as he can and then he hits the ground told you it's useless just accept it for someone like you I am the worst possible matchup Guru Guru did put some thought into this and they all split back up after he just cut them Heh. <laughs> get buried and atomic samurai put down his sword and starts slashing the ceiling above him roof ceiling pieces are just falling zombie man somewhere is nearby can hear this this vibration what's happening I'm really concerned about the current battle situation are you really that concerned with the way the other heroes are being killed? Someone is behind Zombie Man. When did he? For example, maybe they are being killed like this. And just a giant energy blast, I want to call it like a zero, just comes out of his finger. And you can see like three other energy blasts on the sides of it coming out too. Then even more of just like waves of energy you can see. It's like the flowing fist energy waves going over them and more just starting up by him going towards Zombie Man. And then just explosion. And you see him and we get the name of him. And the disaster level. Instant death. Without any time for resistance. Disaster level. Dragon. Homeless emperor. Is this the end for the one they call hero? How underwhelming. I've checked the official hero association website. You know there are. 17 S-Class heroes, right? I can eliminate that number all by myself. Hold up. He's <laughs> charging with the axe. Homeless Emperor is like, Come get me. I'm not afraid. And then he points out his finger and sh blasts off both arms of zombie man and the head of zombie man but he can regenerate right and it's just smoldering he's just smoldering on the ground and an emperor homeless emperor shoots at him again the body and then Zombie Man somehow gets a shot off. But. Somehow. He got one of the energy blasts. Homeless Emperor. Got energy blast in the way. And it blew up. Sending Zombie Man against the wall. Well. Homeless Emperor is just standing there. You see. Zombie man just regenerating. Looks like it hurts. He managed to block such a close range attack. Tiss. I had totally prepared this as a hidden ace. And he just reaches into him. Zombie man reaches into him and just pulls out a gun. 
just flips it over into his hand. And you have Zombie Man there with his sword on the ground. Sword on the ground and the gun in his hand. Starts firing at Child Emperor. Child Emperor starts sending energy blasts out. And just a giant fucking explosion. God damn. I call him Child Emperor. Sorry. Homeless Emperor. As expected of one of the top heroes. Unfaltering, even in death. You certainly were strong. That's the end. That is the end right now. And you can just see Zombie Man. Just. He's just a remain standing there. But as we know, he can regenerate as much as possible. So. This is definitely going to be a fight that consists. And we also have Atomic Samurai still on the wall for this. Shit. It's going to be goddamn awesome. To see. This is 10 out of 10. I'm giving this 10 out of 10. It's fucking incredible. See the uh, fight and how it's going. It's goddamn amazing. So, Zombie Man versus Homeless Emperor. Atomic Samurai's cutting the roof above him to make pieces fall onto Black Sperm. We know Child Emperor's coming back down here somewhere. Because he's fucking pissed at Wagama. Because Wagama is an ass. Was there another child down there? Is there another child down here? No. I'm the only one. Okay, let's go then. And then gets outside. Did you lie about you being the only one there? Well, I wanted to be safe. Fucking asshole. Otherwise, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, we definitely have some epic fights here. I really don't think Guru Guru is dead though. Like I really, really expect he's not dead. Not Guru Guru, I mean Orochi. Orochi This is going to be called, like, Zombie Man using his ace in the hole. <laughs> Zombie Man using his ace in the hole or Atomic Samurai against the wall. Uh, I don't know. It's gonna be one of those titles, so. We're probably gonna put them both, both in the tags. Oh! Yeah, this is goddamn intense. Um. Holy crap. I just mean. We still have the fight with Atomic Samurai. Versus I think I know what will be in the thumbnail um like I said 10 out of 10 uh, it's gonna be cool to see how this these fights persist and even with 
Orochi being defeated or not defeated. He might come back. Uh, for Orochi being defeated for now, the other S class heroes are definitely taking and beating and pu getting pushed against the wall with the Monster Association. And they're definitely having a fun time because this is more like training for them to get stronger. If they can defeat this enemy, is they could definitely be stronger in the future. But we also have Guru Guru somewhere it's down there. Not Guru. Garu. You know what I do? It'd be cool if he became a hero, but I don't know if he would. He has the qualities of being a hero. We've seen him be a hero and def be a definition of a hero through past chapters of the manga. He doesn't want to become a monster. It could be possible, but I could see him ending up helping and rescuing that kid. That's running right now in there. Yeah, so I could see him rescuing that kid. And they see the hero hunter with a kid and they'll be like, wait, he's helping? And that'll be a whole plot twist for them up there on the surface is the hero hunter leaves with the kid otherwise uh thank you guys so much for watching if you like the video uh, like if you ever on our subscribe to our channel recommend subscribe to channel keep up content otherwise after this will be one piece and fairy tale then you guys will also be getting i think either half-life part five or the last part of dark uh destiny 2 forsaken dlc um i think that's pretty much it um, and then Monday, you guys will be getting Full Mount Alchemist, episode 31, 32, 33, I believe. Yeah, I believe those three. So that's coming out Monday. So, otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have video, like, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, I recommend subscribe to the channel, keep out content. Um, like I said in other videos, if we hit 750 subscribers, we will be doing giveaway. When we hit 1,000, we'll be doing giveaway too. But if we hit 1,000 before the end of the year, I'll be in the Caroline Reaper for a video. But we're growing, and it's goddamn incredible to see the rate we're growing. And I thank you guys so much for helping the channel grow. And like I said, these fights are just becoming better and better we could have even more fights pop up but I don't even know who would pop up next with a fight but I think he might finish off these two fights or at least one of these two fights before he starts another there definitely could be more fights down here for them to have otherwise like I said thank you guys so much for watching and uh have a good morning, have a good afternoon, have a good night, wherever you are. Just have a good day. Hope I see you guys next video. And uh, peace.